www.jamblee.com. Today we're in London's Pottersfield Park. Um, over there is the Shard, we've got Tower Bridge over there, and then down the road is London Bridge as well. Today, this is the first time that an event like this is happening to celebrate and advertise the Vietnamese culture. So let's go inside and check out what's there on offer. So I've just taken a bite of this classic banh mi, um, which has the pork, um, it's got some pickle, coriander, spring onion, chilli um, and this uh, pate in there as well inside this baguette. Obviously as we know Vietnamese had a really big French um, influence. I've just taken one bite and all of those tastes has just exploded in my mouth and I've got this heat running around the whole mouth right now. Really, really good. Hey guys, it's my turn to eat now. So what I have here is the Vietnamese summer roll. Now this is like a proper staple. You're gonna to go to any Vietnamese restaurant, this will be on the menu. Right, so what it's made of is um, uh, uh, like a rice skin, which is dipped into hot water, which makes it uh, soft, so it's more pliable. And then they wrap it in some vermicelli, some lettuce, cucumber, and uh, poached prawns. Now usually they serve this with some vinegar that's mixed with uh, fish sauce and sugar and chili but today we only have um, sriracha and hoisin sauce so all right cheers mm. um, it's really refreshing it's light and it's a great snack so you get a crunch from the uh, carrot the lettuce and you get the, the chewiness from the skin as well delicious so what i'm eating now is uh the beef pho or as i've been taught in vietnamese you call it the pho bo which is the beef so again this is the classic vietnamese dish um the broth is slow cooked with um the uh pork and beef bones so It'll maintain some of the bone marrow in there. I'm just going to try some of the pho, the noodles. These are rice noodles. That's good. I'm going to try some of the beef now. The beef is chucked in raw, but it's cooked very quickly. So as not to get too tough. This is good stuff. guys now I'm gonna have some Vietnamese spring rolls um, again this is a, a very special type of pastry it's not like your normal Chinese spring roll this is actually made out of rice um, so it's similar to um, the ingredients that you use to make the summer roll so I mean oh this is like cooked fresh literally just took this out from the oil so I'm dribbling already all right I'm just gonna dip this into this um, fish sauce all right let's, let's test it Oh man, come closer. All right, let's analyze this. So we have the minced pork, this uh, vermicelli, spring onion, carrot, uh, some Chinese um, fungi, uh, which is like a black kind of fungi that you soak into water. It's really tender, flavored fantastic. It balances really well with this sauce as well. This is a must when you have Vietnamese food. So, the next thing I'm gonna eat now is the squid balls. And this is another staple in Vietnam. Um, what they do, how they make it, is basically they've got a large amount of squid, they mash it up in uh, pestle and mortar into this gooey paste, then they flatten it out, shape it, and they deep fry it. It's really good because even though it's got that gooey texture, you can still taste the blobs of um, squid inside it and then I think the sriracha gives it that extra kick but what you do get is um, a lot of the 
the pepper taste coming out. That's pretty good. So I've just had some of the um, Vietnamese iced coffee. It's pretty cool. If you like your coffee, obviously you're going to like the iced coffee, frappuccino, Starbucks. Ain't got nothing on this. <laughs> you got the, you got the um, fragrance of the coffee. Again, it's running through your mouth. It's very refreshing. It's a nice compliment to go with um, the savory foods that we've just had as well. The bad meat and the fat. Right. And watch out for our next video.